World of Dentistry Dental Solutions for Your Dental Needs Non-Carious Cervical Lesions Welcome to our video today where we will talk about non-carious dental injuries. Although dental caries is the best known, there are other injuries that affect our teeth and are just as important. Have you ever noticed pain or sensitivity in your teeth when chewing or drinking hot or cold food? It may be a non-carious dental lesion. First of all, we are going to talk about what non-carious dental lesions are. These are defined as a wear or loss of the hard dental tissues, known as enamel and dentin, which are the outermost layers of the tooth and which protect the dental nerve. They are called cervical lesions because they are observed in the area close to the gum, near the junction of the amalica cement, which could be called the neck of the tooth. In this area, the enamel is thinner and changes in temperature and touch are felt more intensely. So, what signs and symptoms do these lesions present? They may present an increase in the sensitivity of the teeth during brushing, as well as when ingesting hot or cold food and drinks. This is one of the main reasons why people visit the dentist every year. Now we are going to talk about the causes of non-carious dental lesions. They are divided into four types, abfraction, abrasion, erosion, and attrition. Abfraction is a loss of tooth structure, a variable size, seen as a deep, wedge-shaped cavity with sharp edges near or at gingival level. It can occur in one or several teeth at the same time. The most common causes are bruxism, clenching and grinding of the teeth, and dental malocclusion, abnormalities in the bite. Abrasion refers to the loss of tooth structure due to a mechanical cause. It is seen as lines or ridges on the tooth, but as it progresses, these lines change color to yellow-brown. In more severe cases, this lesion can affect the gums, causing them to recede and uncover part of the root of the tooth. The most common causes are improper brushing and the use of abrasive toothpaste, as well as excessive use of dental floss or electric toothbrushes. Erosion is a loss of tooth structure caused by acids. These acids can come from food and drinks, such as red wine, fruit juice, or even from acid reflux problems. This lesion is seen as a loss of enamel on tooth surfaces, and it may be more common in people with stomach problems or who consume large amounts of acidic foods and drinks. Finally, attrition is the loss of tooth structure caused by natural wear. It can be caused by aging, overuse of the teeth, such as biting down on hard objects or bite problems. This lesion is seen as a loss of enamel and dentin on the tooth surface. In summary, non-carious dental lesions are a common problem that can cause tooth pain and sensitivity. Note that these injuries can be caused by factors such as bruxism, dental malocclusion, improper brushing, the use of abrasive toothpastes, consumption of acidic foods and beverages, aging, and bite problems. If you suspect a non-carious dental lesion, it is important to visit your dentist for proper evaluation and treatment. That's all for today. We hope this video has been useful to better understand the today's topic. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more information.